While today marked the first day of the state lifting most of its restrictions, such as social distancing, capacity limits and mask wearing and more, not all places are saying goodbye to those restrictions. KSBY News reporter Gina Avalos has more on where that applies. Although we will see a lot more people not wearing masks from here on out, healthcare facilities are still requiring those who enter the building to have their mask on. And according to Chief Medical Officer Dr. Scott Robertson here at Marion Regional Medical Center in Santa Maria, that will probably be the case for the months to come. Hospitals across the Central Coast are seeing little to no change after the state reopened on Tuesday. Even though mandatory social distancing capacity limits and mass restrictions were lifted, with guidance from the California Department of Health and Cal OSHA, healthcare facilities will still impose those restrictions for the best interest of patients and staff. And right now, we still feel like it's best in these clinical environments that we continue with masking in order to prevent any unnecessary transmission of infection. In places like Cottage Health, Dignity Health, and Lompoc Valley Medical Center, staff who are vaccinated will no longer have to do weekly COVID-19 screenings. It goes through our ER through admission and they're fully vaccinated and had that two-week period since the last vaccine. They no longer have to have that screening test as well. Fully vaccinated patients who are going into any kind of surgery no longer have to get tested for COVID as well. Patients can have a maximum of two visitors daily. And when the visitor is in the hospital, they have to remain masked at all times. And they have to, uh, even when in the patient room, and so they're not allowed to bring meals in or things like that if they want to. Health officials say the pandemic is not over and now is not the time to let your guard down. As for mask wearing at healthcare facilities, they do not expect that to stop anytime soon. Well, I certainly think that masking in clinical uh, environments like hospitals and doctor's offices will probably continue for the near future. Uh, the flu season will be here before we know it. And so we'll have a good idea about what we need to be doing here over the next several months. Those who do enter healthcare facilities will still be screened at the door, similar to what they did prior to reopening the state, which includes temperature checks and checking for COVID like symptoms. In Santa Maria, Gina Avalos, KSBY News. According to Lombok Valley Medical Center, for the first time since the pandemic, none of the 141 patients who were tested for COVID tested positive during the last seven days. That's a record they hope to continue to see.